these are the leftovers of the seafood broil mom prepared for me. around 4 15 p.m. Yeah, when I initially had the seafood broil I had everything with my hands but now I'm using this fork because for the other thing of crab legs the other portion and what was saved for later Mom got the crab meat out of the crab legs for me. After I finished the initial portion of seafood broil. We couldn't find the initial tool used to crack open crab legs at their joints. That, if I recall correctly, was included as part of a man crate. Mom got me. Uh, one Christmas. Within the past few years. This crab meat is delicious. You have to put in some work to ultimately get to it, but it's part of the experience. And it's ultimately worth it to me. Also, I included a couple of mild cheddar cheese sticks. Since those always taste good. So to crack open the crab legs, we ultimately ended up using a pair of pliers. Yeah, I recall mom finding in the basement. I recall waking up today and getting up today around 12.15 p.m.
after staying up until about four, from what I recall, four in the morning. I recall roughly from 6 to 7 p.m. I walked to Wegmans to return some container deposits for plastic, primarily plastic bottles and aluminum cans, though there was one glass bottle. in that white plastic garbage bag. I recall there being another such bag, this one more full, but I decided to save that for tomorrow, potentially, since walking to Wegmans to return whether that's to return container deposits like I usually do or something else. It's good exercise and I figure if I can make doing that every day a habit, after some time I'll ultimately end up healthier. If I recall, it was in the mid-40s in terms of degrees in Fahrenheit today. Yeah, but the sun was still out. around the time I walked to Wegmans. The birds were still singing somewhat. There were some good views. It was an enjoyable experience. I got back 85 cents in container deposits, although when I got back home, I ended up accidentally dropping them and had to briefly look for them yeah, with it pretty dark for me since yeah, my glasses are transition lens so yeah, when I'm outside on a sunny day they kind of temporarily turn into sunglasses yeah, which is convenient but Even when I get back inside, they stay sunglasses for a little bit. 
Yeah, but I was still ultimately able to find the coins just fine. Yeah, I just had a bit of difficulty with it. I'm currently running DPS Idle in the background. At some point shortly after I woke up today after going to bed, I did guild loyalty for the merchant guild in order to increase the boost to gold production that the guild gives. Yeah, I knew I would lose some progress since I would lose all of the bonuses I got from both the Merchants Guild and the Warriors Guild, but yeah, ultimately I also knew that I would quickly get that progress back and then surpass it, so it didn't really matter that much in the end since I think at this point I've managed to make most if not all of the progress I lost back. And as I played through the first few days, which cards silvering increases my DPS, and thus I ultimately silver has changed. I've gone from, for the blue deck, silvering the ice sword cards and ignoring the captain cards to silvering the captain cards and pretty much ignoring the Ice sword cards.